Finn, you gotta help me. Oh, do I ha do I gotta help you? Someone's robbed my dangs. <laughs> Someone, someone's robbed your dangs. What should yeah. we do about that? Um. Well, we should kill them. Oh. <laughs> you know what? Sometimes these solutions. Is it me or does the shadow of that plant look like a very sexy um, Amazonian woman? <laughs> Is that just me? <laughs> I, I can't see it. I think that's the, just the, you. The, the plants in the middle look like she's wearing like a a, a, a leaf top over her giant <laughs> bosom. Uh, the the leaves at the bottom look like her her bottom, as it were, jutting out uh, when she has a very thin waist. And then she's got one of those fruit things on her head, a fruit hat. And she's got a penis. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, the Aborigine woman penis. Wait, I said Amazonian, didn't I? Yes, they're, you did. They're all the same. They're all those moco moco sorts. <laughs> all right, we're gonna go to the dining hall because we need to go and have breakfast with the rest, um, with the rest of the people that are still alive. D d Dad, what's for breakfast? <laughs> <clears throat> oh, this again. Mm-hmm. I love the way that table just fucking slams in on its side. <laughs> Well, she said it. What? Oh, morning. G good morning. Is everyone here already? Can you not fucking see? Yo, yo, yo. Nope, still wait on Pia and Taka. No one will notice my pimple on my upper lip. <laughs> Bia Kuya is no surprise, but it's strange Taka's not here yet. That is very strange. They're killing each no, other. <laughs> no, in Taka, I imagine he's trying to get the king of tardiness up and out of bed. But the fat guy's here. <laughs> <laughs> he finished his morning, ma his morning routine. I'm sure they'll be here soon. Just be patient. Let's see. I don't mind waiting for them, but there is one problem. Which is... <laughs> I'm thirsty. You can drink without them! You don't need their fucking permission! Come on. How the hell is that a problem? You see what I mean? They're on the same wavelength as me sometimes. Hey, fool me. Would you make me some tea? I second that. <laughs> milk tea, if you please. Did you know milk tea in Japanese? If, 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 it, it, milk and tea is ginyu ocha. But if you want to order a milk tea, you say miruku tea. <laughs> I'm not fucking kidding you. If you say Ginyu Ocha, they'll be like, you want milk and tea? That's, that's not a thing. Ah, you, you... <laughs> oh, Miracle Tea! <laughs> Look by me. Let's see. Your roundish figure reminds me of the owner of the coffee shop I used to frequent. You're a cunt. <laughs> I can feel my throat drying out. Quickly, please. Maybe, like, undo that fucking choker then, you idiot. <laughs> oh. um... Wow, he's eating them fingers. <laughs> he is can, fucking can, you, try, you try doing that. Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. You could say, bubble. <laughs> Apparently unable to refuse Celeste's order, Ifumi skulked his... Skulked, uh. His way into the kitchen. I think that's what you say. What you say when you skull fuck someone. He was bitching in the kitchen. A few minutes later. <laughs> <laughs> A few minutes later, he suddenly grew out the ground. A second one. <laughs> oh no! That's creating matter. <laughs> Make you for Biden. Ifumi reappeared with a tray in hand. Did he? Did he, though? <laughs> Is that what happened? <laughs> he ate it. Mmm, -hmm, finally. <laughs> <laughs> you could have made some for the rest of us, you know. There's no way to think Fuck you! It's all about the new bolt law bababbly. Basic instinct, act every day. What? What? <laughs> <laughs> What's for breakfast? <laughs> Stop fucking. 
<laughs> no. then, if you don't, if you don't mind, I got to show you that fucking clip from Filthy Frank's video soon. <laughs> I've seen it. I want to show you again. <laughs> a small smile played across her lip. That looks bigger than small. As she held the teacup delicately in her hand, under her waist. Oh. Wait. I don't have a teacup. <laughs> She cooked her head <laughs> and threw the cup as Oh. Oh! What? Baba! Baba! What are you doing, my baby boy, baby? What the f- I hate this kind of tea. What the fuck? Um... I don't know, the man. Yes, indeed. Imagine we are at a coffee shop, just any normal everyday cafe. I sit down and I order some tea. They ask, they then ask me, would you like lemon or milk? Lemon tea sounds disgusting. Now, further imagine that I replied, ah yes, I would like milk tea please. Did you put a lemon in it? In this case, along with my tea, they may bring me a small container of milk, yes? Did she want it fucking separated? <laughs> But this is not for me. I am among those who prefer the milk to be part of the process from the outset. Oh, for fuck's sake. The fragrance is just so overwhelming. Fucking overwhelming shut so up, you, you entitled cunt. Adding milk or lemon right before you drink is like dousing your fries in ketchup. Mere condiments. What? Fuck off. Whenever looking for a cafe, I first review their menu to see if it offers the proper style of milk tea. Fuck off. And I cannot acknowledge any milk tea that does not add the milk during the brewing process. Ah! If I had to describe our shared reaction and what I just heard, it was fuck you, you fucking cunt. <laughs> but I went through all that trouble to make me that tea. And you want me to go eat my bubba? Yes, I realise it can be a bit of a hassle. <clears throat> you're a cunt. You know you're a cunt. You're okay with you <clears throat> being a cunt. Even in cafes that offer proper milk tea, it is always more expensive than simple tea with milk. If you don't adapt to milk tea, you will die. <laughs> it takes more time to prepare, surely, but... When? Why even bother creating a menu if you are not going to offer the highest level of quality? To make money. Fuck you. Well, um, we don't actually have a menu. You little bitch. That does not matter! Hurry up and bring me what I asked for, swine! It's pronounced Swinehood. <laughs> Did you notice her voice changed? Yeah. Yay! I'm not reading that. <laughs> That's too no, kinky. Read, read it to me. Read it to me. A little piggy. A little piggy. I, I do so love coercion. You were like a totally different person right now. She bipolar. Uh. Yeah, shit. You really went psycho there. It was hot. <laughs> <laughs> I knew there was more to her enemy. <laughs> Seriously, man. Where the fuck she... did that come from? She um. I've spoken to her. I've I've I filled out her report card. She uh, grades her friends based on ranks. So do I. Yeah, but she has A's, B's, C's, and D's. So do they. <laughs> <laughs> if Umi's some solid D's right there. Ah. <laughs> uh. oh. You gonna read this? Give me some fucking time to recover from the hilarity. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Little piggy. <laughs> the dining doors flew open, and one of the late arrivals came storming in. But... <laughs> Bad news, everyone. There was a mystery afoot. No, not be a kuya, yabba! Huh? Yabba dabba do ya. Oh, <laughs> would seem Biokuya refuses to leave his room. I stood there pressing his doorbell over and over, but he never showed himself. Apparently that was annoying. Maybe he just wasn't there. I think maybe... I'd like to think so, but I'm worried something might have happened to him. No! What he meant by that, 
He didn't have to say anything else. Everyone understood exactly what that might mean. It might be a good idea if we all split up and go looking for him. Oh, I was just about to suggest the same thing. He's not dead though, because you've already uh, you've already said he's great in class trials. Plural. <laughs> What's your problem? What's for breakfast? <laughs> and we haven't had any free time yet. <laughs> okay, then I'll go check his room one more time. I'm just gonna keep on hammering that button till I get a response. Ah, the idiots, fucking method. Well. <laughs> <clears throat> Very well. Then the rest of us can go check the rest of the building. Uh, um. Yeah, before it's, you know, too late. This isn't really my hair, by the way. It's seaweed. I painted brown. <laughs> and my mouth is just a sausage that I glue onto my chin. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, we have to just do our best to find Biakuya. So where might Biakuya have gone? Any? Do you know? Do you have any thoughts? Um, let's see. He's Biakuya. He was doing something in the library. What was it? What did he say? Something. I can't remember what he said, but that might be I can't relevant. What he said Maybe he went to go check out the second floor of the school again. Uh, I mean, that's dead. I mean, if it's telling me that, then it means he's probably up there and I should go look there. Yeah. Um, that way is not the way. That is actually the second floor of the dormitories. Oh. Um. So you gotta go all the way to the other end of the. Or you can teleport. No, I'll take a stroll, it's nice. If you say so. Oh shit, we didn't look at the timer. <laughs> we have not set a timer, have we? Uh, set eight minutes, I think. It hasn't been just eight minutes, it's been longer than that. Uh, my likes. Alright, ten minutes then. Okay, so add fifty to whatever. Like, put a timer for fifty on if you can. Okay, if I will. be so kind. Yeah, I can do that, and it will only blare off in my ear as opposed to on the video. Oh yeah, she wasn't there either, was she? Hello. <laughs> Hello. Oh! Why am oh. I waist height to you? Low Kyoko. <clears throat> so you thought to come here too? Huh? <laughs> no, I was just wondering. <laughs> if you think about what Biokuya was so interested in yesterday, you can probably guess where he is right now, right? Huh? So I'll what let you it? figure that out. You need to figure out this mystery for yourself. Yeah, this is another one of those mysteries you gotta. Maybe he's just taking a shit. <laughs> What, well, he went all the way here just to take a shit? He's taking a beer coup, yeah. Oh, there's a third floor. Yep. Um... Oh, a hey, Makoto. So, did you find Bia uh, I'm No, I didn't see him anywhere. I see. But... Somehow, Kyoko figured out where he might be. Huh? You know? Kyoko's so amazing and sexy. She's so cool and sexy. She's smart, and she seems really tough. Like, she'd just tie you down and fucking take you. Oh! <laughs> She's definitely smart, that's for I mean, sure. If, if, if art that people have drawn online is anything to go by. <laughs> Compared to Saku Sakura or even Hina. You're having, you're having a laugh, right? Maybe Sakura, but she's definitely tougher than Hina. Hina doesn't no, seem she's tough. Saying, no, no, she's saying... Wait, no, no, I don't know what he was saying. <laughs> about Kyoko. We're saying Kyoko's weak in comparison to fucking Hina. Just because you like swimming and you're a bit athletic doesn't mean you're tough. Oh, I bet she's, I bet she's got a proper eight pack. <sighs> You'd love that though, wouldn't you? Oh fuck yes. And the top two are her tits. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Is it weird to compare them like that? I mean, I might have to kill them one day. All right. Okay, so he was interested in the... L I mean, like, you did... Uh, I'll try the library. This is unnerving. Mm. When I opened the door to the library and looked inside, I cried out in sudden surprise. Biakuya! He's dead! <laughs> No! <laughs> we 
We've got to look for clues. There's a plug with the light plugged in. Maybe that was the murder weapon. <laughs> what are you? What are you doing? We got to keep looking for clues. <laughs> Quick, inspect his body. What are you doing? <laughs> What was, he, what was he reading at the time of death? Get off, I'm reading that. <laughs> Twilight. He must have been a vampire. <laughs> of all the things I'd imagine, this most definitely wasn't one of the what that he was reading in the library. <laughs> <laughs> I like the idea that he was jacking off. <laughs> He'd found like a fucking book with some nudity in it. Hey. Oh no, Hifumi already looked. What Remember, he said there wasn't any. <laughs> I'm fishing. What does it look like I'm doing? <laughs> yeah, he's masturbating. You could be quiet. Oh, sorry. Wait, no. <laughs> could you be quiet? Yeah, sorry. Wait, no. <laughs> what are you doing here? Everyone's super worried. We've all been looking for you. Who asked you to do that? <laughs> he's such a dick. We're supposed to meet up in the morning. He's got a point, that. though. I know he does. She's such a dick. I mean, I'd be the same. Like, I'd want to go do some light reading maybe in the morning, and then I'm there, just some fucking cunt comes in. Oh my god, I thought you were dead. I'm like, fuck off. I'm just trying to read a book. We promised we'd eat together. We're not a fucking family. Get out. Can't I get a second's peace and quiet around here? No, I agree with him. The Akuya snapped his book shut. And slowly stood up, smooth and silent as a shadow. What? <laughs> shadow okay. man. Meanwhile, the others must have heard me yell and started showing up one after another. <laughs> Fucking hell. Be a courier, so this is where you've been hiding. The heck you doing here, man? What do you even do in a library? <laughs> we were very concerned. I've only even been in the library to tear pages out to roll up into facts. <laughs> this is where I'd go to get high back in my high school. Well, you had no reason to be. I was just reading. God. I've never read such a coarse novel before. But it might just prove useful at some point. Well... What were you reading? Yeah, How you to kill the, people. You were... A mystery novel. Ooh, so we've got to guess what it is. <laughs> <laughs> this is the mystery novel mini game. <laughs> Wait, so are you gonna use what you were learning did there to betray us? Hmm. Don't be stupid. Yeah, don't be stupid. It's just something to keep in mind. Yeah, what? Naturally. If I decide to fight, of course I'll come up with something original. Otherwise, this game of ours will be totally boring, right? <laughs> it's not often you get to take part in such a high-stakes, high-tension activity. So if you're going to do it, you have to make sure it's entertaining. <laughs> His words sent a chill down my spine and a thrill down my penis. There was an undeniable smile. <laughs> yeah, that's undeniably a smile. On his face. <laughs> As he spoke. He looked like he was actually enjoying himself. Enjoying a, this deranged killing game. Damn you! What the fuck do you mean game? That's fucked up! When we kill people out in the street, we take it seriously. <laughs> There's no whooping and cheering. But it is a game. It's a game of life or death, which can only have one winner. That's all there is to it. He is right. It's a zero-sum game. Zero-sum is my favorite type of tea. <laughs> huh? <laughs> what is going on all the time? It is a part of game theory, a mathematical model. A matpatical model. <laughs> In game theory, we come up with gay theories. <laughs> what we are, what we are Is Celeste now. really the murderer all along? <laughs> Was Celeste actually Monokuma at the same time? I mean, if you look, the color, the color palette is identical. Game theory. Why are there no black people? Is Monokuma black? <laughs> game theory. 
Did Monokuma kill all the black people and consume their souls <laughs> to become half black? Game theory. Did he have to consume two people to get half of a person? <laughs> I mean, they're black. Game theory. Is, is Monokuma three halves of a person? Game theory. <laughs> is Monokuma eight halves of a person? <laughs> Compressed in this... down into two halves of two people? In this type of game, in order for one person to gain something, another must necessarily lose something. In other it is a situation in which participants must compete Take for Take a shot of milk resources. tea! <laughs> I see. You mean like, I kind of feel... Really? Are we really going over the concept of the fucking murder game? We've already been through one of them! Actually... Entrance exams, sports tournaments, job openings, most social interactions fall into this category. Actually, sports tournaments technically aren't a zero-sum game, since the people entering, so long as they haven't paid to enter, aren't actually losing anything. Like, not oh. winning the game keeps you in the exact same position you were before you entered. Everyone must scramble to obtain something which is limited, for you to, like a football. For you to succeed, someone, must, uh, someone else must fail. This also applies to the school life. Oh! In this case, our limited resource is the only one, is the only one of us that can successfully become the black end. So in other Do I need to keep repeating myself in different ways? So this game was designed from the beginning to force one of us to try and defeat all the others. That that can't. Oh. <laughs> this is one this of is the funny. worst pieces of interaction in the entire game so far. This is why adaptation is so crucial. Yeah, you need to adapt to getting stabbed. If those <coughs> who want to escape were to disappear, there would be no reason to continue playing the game. What? But why would I want to stop playing? It's so much fun. He smiled again as he spoke. Did his he? smile was filled with evil intent. It twisted his face into something not human. Or at least an evil human. It sounds as if you do not acknowledge even the possibility that you may lose, am I right? Naturally. Of course. <laughs> you do not speak like the others. Exactly what I would expect from the Tilgami heir apparent. Uh, it's just normal arrogance, isn't it? Just a second. You talk like that, but what if you end up dead? Then I'll be too dead to care. Not possible. I won't. It simply isn't possible. You son of a bitch! Who the fuck do you think you are? I'll put you wrong right here, right now. <laughs> Bam! Dead! <laughs> he did it. <laughs> you know, I still just can't believe it. What? Believe what? <laughs> that an uneducated, brain dead, useless piece of garbage like you has survived this long. Uh, there's only been one murder so far, technically, yeah, so... It's only been a few days. I'm gonna fucking kill you! Like I said, I won't die. You keep saying that, but... Do not bother arguing with him. For him, the concept of losing simply does not exist. He is the ultimate affluent prodigy, after all. A boy raised to succeed from the day he was born. You've never lost either, so you know all about this, you bitch. He considers victory his destiny and has lived his life accordingly. Tests and challenges are merely ways for him to stand victorious, even if it is a life and death situation. <laughs> is that not so, Biakuya? At least one of you seems to understand. Isn't it wonderful? It is because I am the same as you. Games are meant to be won. That's enough. Are you trying to suggest we're on the same level? Close that vulgar mouth of yours! Well, well, I do apologize. You fucking can't! <laughs> I am lying through my teeth, of course. <clears throat> anyway, let me just say this to all of you. You all need to try harder. If an opponent isn't going to give it their best, where's the fun for me? No. That's a terrible way to look at it. What? Hmm? It's because... This isn't a game! Our lives are on the line, you know? To kill your own friends is... Is, you're not my friends. It's horrific! Friends? Who decided that? Huh? huh? <laughs> We're not friends. No, quite the opposite. We're in competition. We're enemies. But, 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 but you know. What? But what? 
Stop trying to force your contradictions on me and just accept what I'm telling you. Um. Um. Come on. Yes? If you have something to say, say it. Otherwise, keep your mouth closed. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Stop fucking around. Hey, shithead! Get off on the bullying people that... You get off on bullying people that can't fight back? You wanna try that on me? I thought you were gonna kill him. Come on. <laughs> so you're back to pretending to be friends, huh? And how long do you think that's going to last? Piece of shit. Fuck you! What? Is that all you can say? <laughs> it's unfortunate you would waste your breath on such empty gibberish. Just punch him in the fucking nose! That's it! You're fucking dead! Hold on, just calm down. Piece of shit. I am calm! Ah! <laughs> How is this calm? I'll fucking kill you! That's the worst thing you can say to someone. How is this calm? Anyway, I don't have any intention of working with the rest of you for any longer. To cooperate during an elimination game is, well, frankly, it's a waste of time. And I hate wasting my time. Waste of time. Not possible. Metal Gear. In oh, whoops. Engaging in friendly group meals is out of the question. Someone could easily poison our food, and I'd rather not become part of the Last Supper just yet. <sighs> Shit. Quit talking like you're in a fucking movie or something. Goodbye. All I'm saying is that ultimately, uh, bye. <laughs> you're all free to do whatever you want on your own. Goodbye. Without a second glance back, Biakuya left. He glanced back the first time, though. There wasn't anything we could do to keep him from going. Unless, like, we stopped him, but yeah. His way of thinking was just beyond anything the rest of us could even comprehend. But... Is he serious about all that? So what do you think? Who do you agree with here? <laughs> um... It's definitely, you're definitely meant to, be, uh, meant to be enemies. You're definitely rivals. But, okay, okay, here's what I but, think. To say, but, to say that to all of them paints you as a target. It really does. He, he did not think that. He did not think that through. That was the stupidest thing he could have done. He should have kept those opinions silent. But I think <clears throat> jumping to the conclusion of, well, gotta kill everyone now is... Uh, stupid. You could I would at least... play the Outlast game. I would just, like, keep a weapon on me at all times, stay very cautious, let them all kill each other, figure out who did it, you know, keep eyes all the time, wait till there's only a few left and it's easier for me. I would do that too, but I'd be, before even that, I would see if we can just get everyone to cooperate so we can try and get, think of a way out. No. Before we committed to murder. If no one is there that I like, I will kill someone. Like, if I don't have someone that I have a... What's, is it is the word prerequisite? I don't know. Um, someone that I already know. Like, if you were there, I would try and go full-on cooperation, and then I would just be, like, watching your back constantly. Because um, you're my buddy. I don't want you fucking dying. We'll just fucking live there together and have fun, and then end up hating each other and murdering each other. Um, such is life. Um, <laughs> but if it was me and a bunch of random strangers, then... What I would do is I'd either be the first to murder, because then there's more people that I can shift the blame onto, or I would wait until there's only two people left. But I would have no problem with, like, I mean, fuck it, I don't know them. It's a horrible thing to say, but... And, uh, it, it is a horrible thing to say, but unfortunately I do agree with you on that. If you don't grow attachment <laughs> to them, then I'm sorry, I don't know you. Well, you're no, expendable I to me. No, I would go a step further than that. I, uh, I can be fairly sadistic at times. I would... Pretend to befriend them get them on my side Then instead of just killing one I would manufacture a scenario where all the evidence points to someone else I mean, He is right it is a because no, the, he's got uh, the right idea. I agree with him 100% But you shouldn't have voiced it. That was the <laughs> stupidest thing you can do So like basically at least, like, at least one of them is now like, well, I'd fucking kill him, no worries. Mm. Like, your biggest defense is befriending p people so they'll struggle with the idea of killing you. <laughs> so there we go. 
He was, without a doubt. <coughs> fuck with me. Well, fuck him then. Maybe. But, but what he said, he might not necessarily be wrong. I don't want the poison for breakfast. <laughs> I mean, can you say for sure someone <laughs> won't poison our breakfast? The dead! Hey, come on, you too, Toko? Yeah, who else? Anyway. Well, it's not like anyone would care even if I was the guy, right? True. No, I wouldn't care. Should be better. I bet you won't want me gone. You all think I'm d disgusting. Yes. Yes. Because you say that. Just, None yeah, of us because think that. you say that. At least I don't, because I'm cardboard. You just think you don't think that. Wow, this is like the fucking racism argument. You know, <laughs> like, you're a racist because you're white. I'm not a racist. You just think that. You don't even know you're a racist, but you are. I know some people like to play the victim, but this is just totally out there. She's, she sounds like Keemstar, man. You'd be fucking stupid. <laughs> you... <laughs> oh, I don't want to fucking read this. I don't want to read. I don't want to be associated blah, blah, with this blah, bitch. Blah, 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 Hey, don't... wait, don't go. Just let her go. Once she gets going like that, there is nothing you can say to bring her back. What if I kill her? <laughs> that should be permanently gone. Oh, the thought. The enticing thought. Ultimately, our breakfast meeting came to an end without answering any questions. R really? Really? Did it? Like, where's Biakuya? We found him. <laughs> what was he doing? We know. Um, now we've even learnt a few things about him. What, what an idiot. <laughs> Jeez, I'm tired already, but I don't have time to take even one day off. I need gotta, to get my- Gotta make- gotta go make friends! Yay! Let's go find Biakuya and befriend him. Oh! Do you wanna- oh, do you wanna go to the vending machine? Yeah! Yeah, let's go show off how awful the- I can't- the, the... wait! Right, so go- go to the main hall. Go- yeah, go through that- uh, that gate on- in front of you. Why is it a gate? Oh no. <laughs> very weird. Why did it make a wood sound? <laughs> Open up the map. Can you see that yen symbol? Yeah, uh, in the I mid it. Yeah, we want to go in there. Right, so we're going to show off what the how how awful the vending machine is, and then we're just going to get all the presents off um, whenever we want them off camera. We... Well, yeah, we want to raise. We want to. Hey, look! It's armored skeptic. Hey, look! It's armored skeptic. Hey, look, well, we want we do want to raise our affection with our, with the characters because we want to fill in their report cards for skills. So there's the machine on the right there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. So you the more so the more coins you put in, the more chance you have of not getting something that you already have. So just put and the strategy is to just not bother and always put in one coin, always, until you get to like ninety five percent repeat chance. Okay. And the music restarts every time, um, every time the uh, the present fades. So I hope you're, I hope you like the Monokuma song because you're going to be listening to the first ten notes of it a lot. Well, no, I'm too quick for it. It can't even, can't even. No, it goes. It's fine by me. And there are about... I don't know how many presents there are, actually. There are quite a few. Oh, well. So, yeah. Just gotta... Just gotta keep... Keep doing this. How many presents are there? Quite a lot! I'll, uh, I'll, I'll find out. I'll find out while you're, while you're grinding them. Okay. How are you today, viewer? You okay? Leave in the comments. Apparently I'm lucky. The mono mono machine. You want to fight me mono a mono? There are uh, 
As far as presents that you can get from the machine are concerned, 90. Christ. Then there are the presents that you get after beating a chapter. Then there are the... Then there are the... Other presents that I've never seen before. And then there are the undergarments. Yeah. Uh. And the oh, and every every character has different level has different levels of reaction to a uh, to a present. But I've got a guide open here because fuck that. They have like. What's the best thing for Biyakuya? Uh, the best thing. Well, Biyakuya actually likes a, um, actually likes a couple of things. He likes um, the best thing for B the best presents to give to someone are ones where they have an A rating reaction to them when and nobody else has an A rating reaction because there's A's, B's, C's, and D's. Biyakuya. He likes coffee, a, the scarab brooch, brooch, the scarab brooch, the golden gun, brooch. the golden airplane, the Prince Shotoku's globe. He also he likes love, the old time. Does he love ramen? <laughs> oh, Junko. Um, it's Junko. Dead, yes. Her one of her A rating presents that everyone else is a C in is a ration <laughs> because she just fucking starves herself. <clears throat> uh, I've got enough presents yet. I want like coffee or something that he would really like. So you need to tell me. You want you want to oh you want to talk to be a yeah, really? Yeah, I love him. He's the best character in the game. Oh. <laughs> Why not? Why not someone like? If not him, then who? Kyoko, <laughs> Hina. I don't like Kyoko, and I don't like Hina. Shihiro? He likes Shihiro. Which one's he again? Uh, she. It's um. Which one's the she? Pro is? The programmer. Oh yeah, but like, I don't dislike her, but she's such a non-entity, you know. Right, That's a brooch! Uh, Scarab brooch! Okay, cool. How about... Juke? Oh. How about Leon? Well, at least Sayaka's dead. <laughs> uh, Celeste? Sakura? Sakura, I'd consider... Oh, I got a rock. Sweet. Um, I don't know, man. Wow, I wonder who that would have been for. <laughs> <laughs> One for old time's sake. Thrilling gameplay. Are you not having fun? Look how shittily animated they are. Dude. I think I think we've got enough presents now. Well, machine says no. Oh, sweet. Cheetos. Right. <laughs> Anytime we want to gather more presents, we'll do it off screen. So, who do we want to go spend time with? It'll be a Guya. Fine. Right, open up the map. Listen, you've already played through this fucking game. I don't like him. Well, fuck you, alright? It's up to me. I guess it is, yeah. Where, where He's probably going to be in the library, but open up the map to find out. Oopsie. Oopsie. There we, there we go. No one's here. Um, on this floor. Oh yeah, whenever we unlock a new floor, the previous floor, everyone oh. just forgets yeah, about it. Everyone just forgets about the previous floor and just commutes to the top one, uh, to the topmost one. It's weird. It's like uh. after we've after we unlock the next floor, Biakuya will never be in the library ever again. <laughs> I've like, read all the books. <laughs> after after we un after we unlock the next floor, Hina will never be in the swimming pool again. Wow. Okay, that one's a bit surprising. Just because they want to populate the, uh, the new floors. He seems to be really focused on that book. Now's not a really good time to talk to him. What? Okay, fuck us then. All right, we gotta go spend no! time with someone else. He's my friend. Gotta go spend time with someone else. Ah. Uh, all right. Who do you want then? Let me guess. Hina. Um, I'm trying to think. Um, well, let's, you like Chihiro, 
So I, I want to pick someone that you like I as well. I don't like Chihiro. Chihiro is just okay. If anything, I like Sakura more than Chihiro. Oh, Sakura then. Whoopsie. Where is she? Actually, she might be in the dorms. Whoopsie. Press the right bumper again. Is that her down there? No, that's Celeste. It's maybe... Where the fuck is she? Oh, she might be in the gym. No, she might be in the swimming pool. There we go. There we go. She's in the changing. She's in the changing rooms. Okay, right. Go to the. Um, go to the swimming pool, then. Um, I, I kind of like him. Mondo, we can hang out with Mondo. Yeah, I just don't like doing his voice though. Well, <laughs> you don't. Have, you don't have to do voices much when you interact with someone. Actually, no, you do if you raise their affection in, in, enough. <laughs> He's gotta be like really fucking hot in that. <laughs> Oh. This is bad. I don't like this atmosphere. Gun doesn't help. Let's spend some time with Sakura. I see. Ah! I regret <laughs> this. <laughs> just place your head carefully. Are you saying you're ready for another lesson? Very well. Prepare yourself and come with me. Sakura put me through a tough but rewarding training session. I can feel myself getting stronger. Does this actually help us then? No. Oh, so no one tries to murder us. Does anyone no. ever try and murder us? Oh. Wow, actually, we are... wait. I can't remember now. Great. I Sakura actually can't and remember. I grew a little closer together today. Yeah, let's give her a present. Right, what presents are best for her? I've got some boxing gloves. Uh, do you? <laughs> they are a B. Seriously? They are a, they're a B. Yeah. All right. What what, what do we do have? You, uh, do you have Do you have the thing above boxing gloves? Right, go to boxing gloves. Uh, God of War charm. That's A. So we'll do that one? Okay. Why? <clears throat> I've been looking everywhere for this. How did you know? Because we got a guide. <laughs> Everything about you is written down. <laughs> You're quite a mysterious man, Makoto. I could say the same about you. <laughs> <laughs> I could say the same thing about you, but then I'd die. <laughs> Seeing Sakura so pleased with something I gave her freaks me the fuck out. <laughs> my post-training break is the most relaxing time of my day. The sensation of your muscles cooling down after heating up during a workout is the only true reward. <laughs> that and crushing the skulls of my enemies! <laughs> <laughs> no <laughs> No matter how many times I experience crushing the skulls of my enemies, I never get tired of it. Do you exercise every morning, Sakura? Mm. Ah, fuck no. What do I look like? A freaking... <laughs> what do I look like? The, the world's greatest martial artist? Unless there are like the that I absolutely woman? can't get out of. Yes, I always do my training. If I don't, I feel restless for the rest of the day. Ha, <laughs> for the rest of the day. <laughs> but I'm amazed you can do it every single day. Doesn't it get tough? I can't say I've ever seen it as tough. It's all so I can get stronger, after all. And I have to keep on getting stronger because my destiny is to fight. Your destiny is to fight? Uh... From the day I was born, I've been fighting. See, the doctors were trying to give me an abortion. <laughs> my mom just didn't want me, but I fucking broke that cunt's wrist. <laughs> Evan sent me to live as its champion. I ripped that wound open with my own two hands. <laughs> I punched my way through her belly button. My mom uh, died during childbirth. <laughs> that is one heck of a legend. <laughs> my favor was my maver. <laughs> and my every waking moment we spend with him learning to fight. As a child, I sparred with boxing champions and hit the mat with wrestling gold medalists. 
That's where I got all these scars from. They fucked me up real good. I was no match for them when I first began, of course. But long after... But, but, but before long, they were no match for me. You mean, you actually started beating people like that? I'd say my specialty is solid stand-up the trend... I didn't see you as a comedian. The transitions into grappling and a strong get ground game. Like Pokemon as well, do you? <laughs> Essentially, it's a complete approach. Anything else just wouldn't make sense. You can only become the best by reaching the top of each discipline, then fusing them all together. Yeah, let me just take a look at this real quick. I'm bored. <laughs> <clears throat> Stand up fighting, grappling, and a sh that could only be... Mixed martial arts. Are you fucking serious? You're basically a mixed martial arts fighter, right? Of course. That's right. It's the most effective real wear fighting style, which is why I choose it. I don't want to just be the best in competitions. I want to be the strongest human on earth. I wouldn't bet against... I wouldn't bet <laughs> against you, that's for sure. Are you fucking imitating me? <laughs> but aren't you already the best? You. No, not yet. There's still someone I have to surpass. <laughs> this is fucking long, long fucking gray-haired bitch in, the, in this fucking window in my room. She seems stronger than me, and I don't like it. <laughs> Really? Until I can beat him, I'll never become the strongest. You mean there's someone out there stronger than you? Yes, you fucking idiot! <laughs> oh, it's so she vanished. Oh. Oh. Great. Skill oh. points, yay. My favorite. Right, now who are we going for? Um, let's try going for Biakuya if we're not going to sleep. Well, it's still daytime. Good. Thanks for bringing me back here. You shit game. Could have just gone straight into the map. Uh, now's the time. Everyone's, uh, everyone's shuffled around. Oh, oh everyone's in, I think everyone's in the dorms now. Is he, wait, wait. Is he? Is he still in the library? He's taking a shit. <laughs> he's... I think he's still in the library. <laughs> he's reading the Demonator. It's a long series. You see... What the fuck? Stop. Stop. Please. I hate that. You see those squares in the hallways? Like, go left twice. Whoops. No. Let... There you go, teleport to there. Go! What's that room next to this? this little... That is the archive. Okay. <laughs> Good to know. Booyah, cooyah. Great! Oh, gr for Christ's sake! I thought you were going to say grow up then. <sighs> oh, grow up! Oh, who are we going to spend time with then? Up to you. Um, Sakura. Sakura. Again? Yeah, I mean, it's not the best idea to spread out your, um, to spread out all your, eff all your efforts because they might die. Like Leon Sakura and is definitely going to die. Like Leo and Junko, for example, I think they only have two paid, um, two extra pages to their report cards. But because we only spent time with each of them once, we didn't fill it out. I don't really care. I can almost feel the wind on my face. Yeah, sure. I admire the almost greedy approach you take towards growing stronger. Yeah, that's not it. <laughs> Now I'd like to begin training you in my family's secret techniques. What's that over you there? Would just... <laughs> <laughs> that you would just share? It's been one day training with her and you... Shut up. <laughs> yes, definitely. I'll give her another one. Because <laughs> I have two of them. I've been looking everywhere for one of these! <laughs> <laughs> I 
I've never seen one before in my life. <laughs> Are you sure? I've given. I've... I've given Biakuya like four old timey radios. Like, not even the entire Togami's influence could uh, could get one of these. What? <laughs> I've given you four. Makoto, I. So then. Since we've already talked so much, it's okay to talk a little more, right? I I actually. <laughs> hey. I suppose I don't mind talking. W wow, thanks. <laughs> it's because it's because the um. The first few messages are th th that first message was reaction to the present. Mm. Really? Then can I ask you something? What is it? Do you have like a penis? You said there's someone stronger than you. Can I ask? Is it? She's already specified it's a guy. It's a. Why are you so curious? It's a filthy man. <laughs> if it walks, if it talks, if its habits are a little bit peculiar. I don't know what that is. That's a song from Fallout. Oh. But is it Johnny Guitar? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> Johnny Guitar, play it again, 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 Johnny Guitar. <laughs> the man that Sakura has to surpass, maybe she's talking about her own teacher, which would mean your dad. <clears throat> you were talking about your dad. Sorry, I zoned out, what? <laughs> The family dojo has been passed down from generation to generation for the past three centuries. Three centuries? That's like 300 years. Mm. I was born into my family. <laughs> male, <laughs> male or female doesn't matter. It's my duty to protect our legacy. Yeah, clearly it doesn't. You, uh, you look just like a guy. And because I am a woman, man, I must be even stronger than if I were a man. <laughs> Some would say that a woman is incapable of becoming the strongest human alive. I want to prove them wrong, so I chopped off my penis. <laughs> Which is why I subjected myself to such feverish training under my father's instructions. Surpassing my father is, was certainly important to me. But that was just a matter of time. What do you mean? I was 14 years old when I first beat my father in a sparring match. After that, I never lost to my father again. Wait, then you're str What? Yes, I have already surpassed my father. My character arc is over. Goodbye. <laughs> I don't believe it. What? what? Well. I'm not just gonna fucking lie to you. I'm not sure I did the right thing. My father also had the desire to become the strongest human alive. But I can't look back. I can only move forward and try to claim that title for myself. That is my destiny. Goodbye. Wait, uh, I... Well, that's all for now. That was enjoyable. Bye! <laughs> Without another word, Sakura left me standing there alone, thinking about her daddy issues. Wait, hold on. I never did find out who could possibly be stronger than her. Did she avoid talking about it on purpose? Okay. Great. Yeah, I've got a skill! Uh, I guess someone dies now. Uh, no, I think we've got another day of free time. Oh, <laughs> Christ, alright, fine. Um, uh, we have, uh, eight minutes left. Good. Do you want to call it, do you want to call it there, and no, at no, the end no, of the no, day? No. no, 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 we'll go through the next day. Okay. But we've got to go to the dining hall, I think, for, for breakfast. No, we don't. <laughs> but we do. We don't have to. No one has to. But it's Makoto. He's so he has to. I'm just gonna read this. No. In the bathroom. Just look. If people want to read it, they can read. Was that? Was that? Oh, okay. He was saying he he himself looks like a cute girl. <clears throat> bing bong, bing bong. Ding dong, cling clong, fing fong, ching chong. Oh, that's sorry, that's racist. Ning <laughs> chong ching. Maybe now we can spend time with Burger. Burger, burger. 
Can we just go up there well, and we eat breakfast with him up, upstairs? Well, since we've talked, since we've got the skill from Sa from Sakura now, I we can actually probably move on to someone else. But who was the strongest? Uh, do you do you really want to find out? Yeah. Okay, well, to keep talking to Sakura. No, then. just tell me. No, keep Why talking not? to Sakura. No, I want to unlock more skills. Okay, even I think it's her boyfriend. I think. <laughs> I think. Not sure. Actually. So she's gay. <laughs> <laughs> what um, my breathing technique does. Um. Well. <laughs> you know techniques that uh, help you relax through breathing. <sighs> just read the. Just read the fucking shit. Breakfast, but. Is this everyone? It feels a little small. I don't. Is there an orgy going on in here? <laughs> <laughs> Miku and Toad go to warmed up an hour and come back. I wonder where he is. That fucking face, Jesus! <laughs> Even the table looks bigger somehow. Uh. I need to peel this piece of salami off my chin. <laughs> I assume that it's because three people are dead and two are abstaining. Yeah, that'd do it. He that said was what it, I said. No. He said what I said. Still, I know Biakui is whatever, but shouldn't we go check on Toko? No. For serious. <laughs> I don't know. She's super annoying. <laughs> How can you be so cold? You are like a piece of rock candy. Which are famous for being really cold. You hear me? What? No rock candy isn't cold, it's sweet. This game just knows me. <laughs> Shit. Anyway, it's corn that's the real problem. If we don't keep an eye on him, he might really kill someone. You can see it in his beady little eyes. We got no choice. Get some rope. We're gonna have to keep him bound and gagged. This this escalated quickly. I think this is going a little overboard. He's right in this situation. There's nothing scarier than when an ally turns loose cannon. Yeah, but he wasn't an ally, and he's not a loose cannon. It's just like when we were kids and someone would go crazy at sports day or whatever. What? What the fuck are you talking about? You gonna use the rope to do tug of war or something? Idiot. It can't be. I'm not an idiot. It can't be. I can't be an idiot. <laughs> You're an idiot. Oh! Uh, who are you calling stupid? No one, I called you an idiot. Great, thanks for your input. <laughs> oh, I'm just going through a little self-loathing. I <laughs> self-loathing? Well, after Actually. what Biakuya said to me yesterday, I just got so nervous I locked up I couldn't say anything. Mondo ended up having to help me out, and even he said I was someone who can't fight back. I, I hate how weak I am. I see, so Mondo made you depressed. What? How is it my fault? Hey, come on. I wasn't trying to be mean. Besides, girls are just naturally weak anyway, right? Fucking hell. Well, actually, girls do have both a physical and mental disadvantage, which is entirely natural. Yeah. He's not wrong. It's I mean, the harsh reality. Like, don't get me wrong, there are women who are smarter and stronger than me, but generally when it comes to, like, IQ levels, for example, men are either really smart or really stupid, with few drifting in the middle, women are all in the middle. Like, there are very few breakaways. So, generally men are smarter than women. Um, which... Generally they're also stupider. <laughs> and, and, yes, on, on, like, they're either going to be smarter or stupider than the women, they're generally not going to be on equal ground. Which is something I've actually had a lot of trouble with, because most of the girls I meet are just, like, averagely intelligent, and I feel I'm on the high end of the scale? <laughs> so, I don't know, I just struggle talking to them, not because I'm socially awkward, but because they're fucking boring. I got my hair done today! Great, um, do you want to talk about something interesting? My hair! Well, you look really nice, by the way. Oh, thank you. 
speaking, so I'm just carrying this conversation. <laughs> um, and, then, and then physically, physically, I mean, like, women are definitely not as physically, like, naturally able as men are. I mean, like, I'd, I'd love to see fucking Susan Boyle outrun Usain Bolt, for example. But it's like, women are inherently shorter and not as strong. It's sad, because I'd love for everyone to be equal, but there are natural differences between everyone, so fuck it. Gah. <laughs> Are you crying? It's because you were screaming what like a lunatic. What the fuck <laughs> is that face? <laughs> hey, come on. Hey, come on. Don't cry. It's my fault, okay? I won't yell at you anymore. Really? Fuck off! Stop being a cunt! I'm sure I can believe that. Shut up! What? I, I got it! What? I'll make you a promise as a man. Huh? <laughs> Are you fucking serious, mate? Yeah, that's right. Maybe I mentioned this before, but ever since I was a kid, there was one thing my brother told me over and over again while he punched me in the face. He said no matter what, a real man always keeps his promises. That's what he left me. Bubble. Oh yeah, my brother's dead. <laughs> oh, I see. That's true. Anyway, I don't want to talk about it. Don't want to make you all you guys cry. Yo. Anyway, so you can trust me when I make that promise. So you don't gotta cry anymore. <laughs> He's dead. Thank you. Thank you, Mondo. Sure, we sound similar anyway. But I still don't like how I am right now. I have to get stronger. Go speak to Sakura. <laughs> if I'm so weak, anything can make me cry. That's not so good. Still, don't stress out too much about having to get stronger. Um... <clears throat> Done. That was the line. <laughs> Maybe I should start working out. <laughs> well, well, well! Did <laughs> Did someone say we're working out? <laughs> <laughs> well, I only know about firearms because you guys walked into the gun show! <laughs> In that case, I'd be happy to help you out anytime. My best move is only when we smashing the baby baby. Just a second. Shut up, you. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Oh, finally cracked a smile, huh? I see. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, I won't do it again. <laughs> Everyone, thank you. I hate that. They say it so much in visual novels and anime. Everyone. Like, to address everyone. It, <laughs> fuck off. Looks like Chihiro's gotten some life back. Soon I'll take it away. <laughs> Yeah, man. Why does he keep saying man now? I don't know. <laughs> if we keep helping each other out like this, we're bound to get out of this crappy place. Whoa! Hey! Whoa! Was that a sliver of personality? That hits like a truck from you. Jesus. Ah, uh, it's gone. I mean, someday, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I just showed personality for a second there. Still, our biggest concern right now is the other two who never showed up to breakfast. What can I d do to try and understand those two better? Avoid them. Like the plate. Well, not be a Kuya, but the other one. Right, shall we call it there, then? We shall call it there, then. What are your final thoughts, Finn? Fun final thoughts. Um, keep your murder plans to yourself. <laughs> Kids, if you're going to kill everyone... Don't say, I, I'm, I'm considering this a game and I'm going to kill you all. Just a thought, you know. Maybe keep that on the down low. Stab them when they least expect it. Don't make yourself a target. This has been an educational message from the Kai Games. Bye!